Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Okay, let's take a look what is going on currently on the euro currency. Uh, you can see, guys, that that was not much change uh, changes from the previous trading session. In fact, the uh, price action uh, develops uh, rather slowly here. Well, and in fact, our setup that we have discussed in our weekly research uh, that currently market could show some uh, deeper retracement on the daily time frame, mostly based on the behavior that we have seen on the previous week, particularly speaking that stab grabber, today's stab grabber and the, the cloud cover pattern that was simultaneously the washing rings of the previous highs, those highs on the daily time frame. Later market has formed another small stab grabber, uh, trend has shifted bearish, uh, although market hasn't quite started the development to the downside. Now we see that mark, uh, that price has tested the weekly pivot point, moves below it and now market holds below the weekly pivot point. The nearest target of this potential move down is that low because that is the minimum target of this stop grabber. Stop grabber suggests usually the taking out of the previous opposite extreme, uh, nearest extreme. And that opposite nearest extreme is right here. It's nearly around 132 Nigeria, uh, 133. That is the level to watch for is the potential target of this pattern. That will be, by the way, uh, the weekly pivot support one. So that will be the first target of this potential move down. Uh, this pattern has deeper target and it stands previous right at the previous ex extremes right here. It's around 130, area approximately. This low. Well, that is the short term setup. So we see that market still holds with these patrons. You can see that price action stands below this highs, this high and that high, that is the validation point of that pattern. So if market will move higher and close above this this top of this candle, it will erase this pattern. Well, we have spoken much about the uh, combination of these two step grabbers and that we have some great uh, assistance uh, in terms of shape of this pattern that we, in fact uh, on the intraday charts we have the hand shoulders pattern and that's very uh, good for us that the, this step grabber is the shoulder if we could call it from that step grabber uh, and if market will fail it simultaneously will probably erase this pattern and that will simultaneously put on the question that pattern so we could get in fact the information that probably all this construction all these contracts will fail already when the market will take out of this high. So we do not need to wait when the market will exceed this uh, top of this pattern. Well, that's why this this candle in fact very significant for us in the short term perspective. Currently mar market uh, hasn't started significant move down yet, but in general these two candles stands in a row with this uh, with overall analysis and uh, currently we can say that something uh, uh, could lead to destruction of this setup because uh, market stands uh, inside of the body of this candle that stop still holds so this analysis is still valid. On the 4 hour time frame chart we see uh, this pattern that we have discussed this uh, head and shoulders that now is in progress. Here we can see how market coil around the weekly pivot point and now shifted to the downside. Well, Based on this uh, head and shoulders pattern we could get the target of this ABCD pattern that stands approximately around 132.50 but as I said the minimum target will be right here that is the low that is the target of the stop grabber pattern here is our in fact stop grabber that takes the shape of the right shoulder of this pattern so let's uh, watch closely what could happen so if you have entered as we suggested on some retracement inside of the body close to the top of this high you now could probably shift your move your stop to the break even and just watch how market will behave here because if market will fail to pass through the neckline return right back it will probably could lead to the failure of the construction because that could give us the butterfly that could be at the left wing of the butterfly if market will fail to continue move lower that could become the right wing market could accelerate further uh, other words to get the confidence that market will continue move lower it should 
break the neckline, it should uh, show uh, to show us that this head and shoulders patient has uh, is, has started to work. Uh, that what we should monitor in the nearest term. That's why as market already has formed the right shoulder. It uh, if it really intends to continue move lower, it should not show any significant bounce and especially taking out of these highs. The, if this will happen, that probably that will be a great challenge uh, in direction of the potential failure of, of the whole construction. Uh, and now we have very comfortable uh, situation since if you have entered short, you already uh, have some profit on this position and you could protect uh, your position with a break-even stop or at least a tight stop to your position. Uh, because that will be absolutely a uh, reasonable action, reasonable stop, step, stop moving, uh, following by the logic of the overall current patron and uh, overall price action. So let's see what will happen. Well, uh, hope that market will um, behave as we suggest, and we probably uh, could make some profit on this 